Hey, Sal, we must have been through this 50 times already. And we'll go through it another 50 if that's what it takes. 9.30, lights out. God begins his rounds. How we doing tonight, Ferguson? Fairly good. Yeah, doing great, Mr. DeLuca. My boy Tommy, he's almost six now. Ain't that swell. Hey, Finn. You get that tip for Saturday's race yet? I'm working on it. Right now. You're gonna shut him up? Or do I gotta do it? You know the rules, handsome. No talking. 935, the weasel launches into a song and dance routine. Damn it, Arlington. You gotta get the doc. Gonna be the real deal this time. Once the weasel gets the keys, we move on to stage two. Let's get moving. Here you go, fellas. Courtesy of the warden's private collection. The boys in the laundry stashed the parts? Of course they fucking did. What the fuck? I killed him. You've been in the joint too long, Al. You've forgotten how to get shit done. <laughs> What the fuck? But I'm gonna break. I'm this ain't right. Something weird's going on here. You don't say, Weasel. Where are those screams coming from? Oh, shit. Tour of the Dead is back on a new map. Mob of the Dead. Bum, bum, bum. Ooh, Ew. spooky, spooky, spooky. It, it's new for us, technically. Uh, so, uh, as I've been alluding to as we've been playing these maps, uh, we have a new player in town, and his name is Jason Blundell, and he decided to make a map, and it was called Mob of the Dead. And Blundell basically took all the design decisions that Zelensky was doing with the previous maps and was like, those are cool and all, but I'm going to kind of rework it and make it fun. And so that is how we got this map. And it is really good. It's a really good map. Not the best map, but really good. Um, it's also a very interesting uh, different direction for the story because we are basically going into a completely different timeline you could say um but that's stuff that i'll cover when we actually talk about the story probably in the easter egg video maybe i don't know um but yeah we're playing in uh alcatraz here and we are playing as these uh mobsters who are trying to escape the prison so let's just i'm get walking here <laughs> i'm talking here uh-huh uh-huh i'm stalking here i'm barking I'm here, here. <laughs> all right macaulay cock in here <laughs> Christ. Um, so yes, we, uh, you can see here we're trying to build a plane to escape the island. That is the pack punch process, but it's also a very neat, uh, this map is very story heavy. Um, at first people thought it was just kind of like its own thing that wasn't really connected to anything else, but then it turns out like, nah, everything, every single map is, has something to do with the overall story. Uh, connect. Kingdom Hearts. It's very Kingdom Hearts S. Uh, so we're going to start in uh, afterlife mode, as you can see. Um, oh, that's weird. Uh, my my sensitivity is a bit too high. Um, 
and you can revive yourself. So, yeah, there's... I'm going to change my settings while I talk about this. So, yes, this map does not have quick revive. It's actually the first map uh, since they've introduced perks that does not have quick revive on it. Uh, where is the... Uh, where's the... Uh, oh, controls, Man, right, right? I haven't played Mob of the Dead for years. This feels... Uh, this feels weird in the fact I'm running at 105 frames per second. It's where we'll find uh -huh. the for the plan. World, it's a new dawn, new day. It's a new life. So yes, um, there's no quick revive on this map, and instead we get this thing called afterlife mode, where every time you die, you will you go into afterlife mode, uh, where you can stuff. turn on parts of the map as well as revive yourself and others. Uh, there are a lot of zombies coming out of here. Um, teacher, teacher. Yeah. The zombie's eyes are red. Yes, indeed. That kind of shows you that we're not in uh, the normal dimension where uh, Samantha and or Richtofen is in control of the zombies. Uh, so yes, afterlife mode you can turn on various parts because this map does not have a central power switch. Um, everything in the map can be turned on individually using afterlife mode. Um, you can see on the right side of the screen, uh, you'll see the little symbol and the amount of afterlife charges you have. So once you are out of those, you will just go into your normal bleed out stance instead of going into afterlife mode. Or if you are in solo, your game will end. <coughs> um, you can also touch the fuse boxes, the red fuse boxes around the map to down yourself purposefully and go into afterlife mode. And if you do that, you'll get to keep all your perks. Whereas if you go down to a zombie, you will uh, lose all your perks. And so that will allow you to go into afterlife mode to turn stuff on without losing your perks, which is nice. Some people say I'm always in Um, oh, Chris okay. is down. Shit. If you guys revive me, do I keep my uh, afterlife? Uh, no. So, oh, Max, are you down too? Yeah, I'm back up. <laughs> Alright, so we, should, we probably should kind of take this slow, um, because... I just got double hit. Alright, or... <laughs> Um, alright, yeah, because, like, you can't, I believe you can't carry more than one charge in Afterlife mode in, uh, this, in, with this amount of players. So, and since you get a new charge of Afterlife mode every round, we want to be starting to open stuff up. So, uh, the first thing's first is we have to find the key. I didn't actually look at the other side to see if it was there. Um, so we should probably do that. But, in any case, we probably don't want to end this round, um, if possible. Okay. So, just get down to the last zombie. Okay. Uh, yeah, so the key's on this side. So, what we can do is I can go to this afterlife box and press it. Press the button. Ah! Smack's dead. Uh, yes. and I'm going to jump up here and zap this, and that will lower the key so I can grab it, or if Chris is right, he can grab it. Uh, I'm also going to run through here and go through this little obstacle course. And I can zap this box to, to open the way to the showers for free. Wow, free? Yep. And I can also come over here and zap this box oh, to unlock this power up in there. Grass! And I have to get back before I uh, run out of meter, or else I will die. Anyone else notice the portal? All right. Um. Okay. Shit. All right, I'm gonna grab the key. So let's get on with the fucking plan. We really need to. <laughs> we need to be thinking about uh, what we're doing here. Where are you guys? So uh, beats one three R right here. Up. A bear. Ain't got time to fuck around with Ooh, the bear. The bear skin bears. Bears and bears. In there. I'm gonna open. Oh, that's two K. Jeez Louise. Never mind. What's with uh? Let's do it. What's with what? The kid in Bear Bear is also named Max. Uh, I thought he was just Brother Bear. And Sister Bear, but I could be wrong. I think you're right. Max, you're getting confused with, uh, Max and Ruby. Or, yeah. or Max from Goofy's. Go go goofy Goof. Or Max from Max right, Keeble's Big um, Goof. Let's, let's not... Let's not what the... Out here. Dead Chris, I'm coming for you. Alright. Another thing to bear in mind are these dog heads around the map. You need to feed these with zombies, and you get a reward once you feed all three. Oh, have found one? Oh, should probably start. Yep. So, I don't know if it's the last zombie, though. Let's not kill any more zombies, unless we're sure it's not There's the last two one. two zombies by me. Three zombies by me. Alright. Uh, do you want to bring them up here? Right, two are dead. And this okay. is the last zombie. Okay. <clears throat> well, let's, let's start using some afterlife mode. So, let's go through here. 
And one of y'alls can use it uh, here. I use mine. Oh, you already used this. Max, do you still have your full charge? Uh, yeah. Where are you? I don't know. Come on. Yeah, the cell block is kind of the most confusing place in this area, I think. Alright, Max, so you can hit this box. And I want you to jump up through that area up there where you see the portal. Come over okay. here and jump up through there and then go uh, around to the right and you should find some stairs. And yeah. you'll just want to go around and zap that. There you go. So you got that. So come on back. Oh, I'm a go! Okay, and then come over here. Assuming you have time. What are you at? Oh. In here. And then go ahead and zap the speed cola machine. And then you can come back and get your body. <laughs> oh my way! Okay, cool. So we open up the warden's office here, and we have speed cola open. Oh my Chris god, is dead again. <laughs> Shit. Double hit. There we go. I thought you'd put me on ice. All right, so let's go this way now, because I still have my afterlife charge, so we want to use that. And I think we should use that on the shower. Oh, shit, there's more. Let's, uh, let's try and feed the dogs more with these guys. Um, yeah, so what was I saying? Oh, yeah, so there was a part for the plane in there. One of the things they're trying to do is find all five parts to build a plane on the roof. Uh, but the cage to get to it is electrified, so we can't get in there just yet. So one thing I, I've never really liked to say, you have to wait for the dogs to swallow the food before you kill the next zombie. Uh, but it is what it is. Alright, hopefully that's like Oh my god, zombie! that the last one? Yeah, it is. Alright, so we got one of the dogs down. So let's go to the shower rooms now. Oh, you want to take a shower the guy, Riley? Sure, dog. Chris, I assume you're uh, you're following us. Uh, mm-hmm. All right. Well, if you need help, we're going back to the spawn room towards the uh, the other side. I got you. I got you. Unless you're going a different way. <laughs> no, no, I got you. Okay. Well, uh, I opened this up with my uh, afterlife, so we're gonna go in here. Also, uh, the cafeteria's in there. Sometimes the box the bo yeah, the box can spawn in there. Ooh, um, huh. So we're going to go in here, and I'm going to use the Warden's Key. I believe we should all be able to use the Warden's Key. Um, I'm going to use that to open this up, and we're going to turn that washing machine on once Chris is down here. But first, I have to uh, zap it with uh, Afterlife Mode. Okay. Oh, yeah, that, that, that. So, are we all down here? Yes, sir. Alright. So, I'm going to turn this on, and I believe this is going to spawn uh, the boss zombie of this map. So, we got to be ready to kill him. Uh, yeah, he's right here. Okay. So, be careful not to kill him. Kind of hard with the, the zombie, yeah, yeah, too. Yeah. I, I think I got it, though. Oh. I just killed the zombie. Damn, how? I was just shooting at him. That's alright. There we go. Uh, let's wait to pick that up until the zombies start spawning, but I'm gonna go to the washing machine and grab the, uh, the uniforms out of there, so that's the first plane part piece we've gotten. Eventually. There we go. Um, so in multiplayer, uh, grab that mix. In multiplayer, uh, you can only carry one part at a time. So you have to carry them individually up to the roof as a team. In Solo, Blondell made the great decision where you can just carry as many parts as you want of anything. Um, and you can also do that with the uh, the other buildables in this map in multiplayer. You can just carry all the pieces uh, and just put them together whenever you want. And you can also put them together on any table you want. There's like three tables on the map, but only two buildables, so you can decide where you want to put stuff. So just little little changes to the, uh, the buildable system that Blondell made that are really, uh, really convenient. So I think we should start heading down towards the, uh... Is that another Brutus spawning in? <laughs> Why? Yeah. What the fuck is that? This is okay, so Brutus, you can see, is uh, going around and locking stuff up. And he can lock up basically anything on the map. Um, and you have to pay... Oh, where did he just go? I don't know. He's gone. That's weird. Uh, you have to pay $2,000, 2,000 points to, uh... 
to unlock it. I think he's back. But we're also in kind of trouble in that the zombies are just spawning now. Oh, there we go. He does take bonus damage if you have insta-kill, which is nice. Alright, let's be very careful not to end the round because we want to, uh... Uh, this is like the beginning of the round. Yeah, I know, I'm just... <laughs> we, we, uh, we're kind of getting pretty far in here. Uh, so, Max, is that you? You're blue? Okay. So I think Max and I are going to start heading down to the docks, Chris, if you want to follow. Okay. Um, so we're going to pick up the oh, God. plane part here. So, Max, you can do this bit. What are we doing? Uh, I'm gonna come down here and unlock this little box at the bottom. Good. And if you're sitting at the top, that's fine. Very atmospheric. So, Max, uh, uh, at the top, go ahead and use the fuse box up there. I'm gonna pick up this piece. And run down the stairs and make take note of the numbers as you run down, the oh, blue numbers on God. the wall. Okay. Eight. Fuck, Chris, can you come revive me? One. Uh, actually, actually, oh wait, myself. that's not you. Never mind. I forgot. I could just provide myself. So eight one seven max. So go ahead and type that, or eight one six. Go ahead and type that into the uh, thing. Yep. So. Done. So who's who? Are you at the very bottom? Or? Uh, yeah, we're going down the bottom to the to the bottom of the spiral stairs, and then you can go get your body back, Max. Uh, so now we have sixty seconds to get this part, which I can do pretty easily. Um, I'm also gonna grab an Uzi because we're getting pretty far in these rounds, and uh, I'm not too comfortable with an M14. Alright, uh, actually, ah! someone else needs to get this. Uh, can one of you come okay. down to the bottom here and grab that? I I'm at the bottom? What am I grabbing? Uh, where are you at the bottom? I'm right behind you. You are? Oh, there you are. Alright, go down there and pick up the piece down there. Alright, go pick up that. <laughs> yep, I got it. And hopefully we will not end the round. Alright, cool, so we have two pieces now. Now we're cooking. Keep it up, fellas. Max, I am on the way. So one thing you can do in Afterlife is you can zap the zombies with your lightning attack, and it'll teleport them away, so you can clear some room for you to get back up, which is nice. It's the precursor to anywhere but here. I guess. Is that the last one, Chris? Yeah, I think so. Okay, let's try and get past it. You have so much money, holy shit. <laughs> you can open up the rest of this area. Uh, okay. Wait, where'd you guys go? Uh, we're going to the bottom, because okay. we want to get to uh, Jug next. Because both of you guys have enough to get it. Uh, do we have any afterlife charges between us? I have one. Okay, good. Alright, so we're going to come out here. And we'll open up the area to the docks. And Jug is right there. Uh, and... Zap, zap. While, uh, we also want to unlock the plane part for Max to pick up here. While we also get Jug. So what we're going to do is... Um, I'm going to open this up. And Chris, I want you to use your afterlife charge... Yeah. And zap that to open it up for me. Okay. And then after you do that, too? uh, well, I oh god, I'm just getting around because it's scary. Uh, so zap it for me, and then I'm gonna grab it. Oh wait, Max, yeah. you have to grab it here. Zap it again so you can let Max in. I keep forgetting we can't carry more than Is one. Is it still open? It's yeah. still open. Uh, no, no, zap, zap it again. There you go, because it, it opens one and closes the other. So zap it again. And then Max, you grab it, and then yeah. zap it one more time to let us out, and then go see if you can get Jug up. And if you can't, I can get it. Max, uh, what, what, what's your gun situation look like? Bear. Bear? Alright, oh, uh, if you have enough, Max, you can pick up a Tommy gun there on the wall. Oh no, I don't- Chris, you got Will it. Will I teleport back to my body? No, you die if you uh, do that. I gotcha, I gotcha. Thank you. Ugh, I need to- actually, I'm gonna try and do stuff in afterlife mode. Right. It's actually fine. It's nice because it's okay to go down early on because you can just do stuff in afterlife mode because you didn't lose any perks anyway. I think Max went down. Yep. Alright, so I got that. Chris, did you get Jug? No, I wasn't able to get it. Okay, I'll get it. And then you guys can oh, God. pick it up. Oh, fuck. Go. <sighs> so Jug is open whenever you guys want to go grab that. You can also hear, like, voices and shit, which is kind of neat when you're in afterlife mode. I, I think that might be a multiplayer only thing, because I don't really recognize that in a single player. Single player? Yeah. Alright, let's not end the round, ideally. Okay, I was just trying to really a lot of zombies here. I know, just like, every round we give a- it's another piece. I'm picking up the pieces to the zombie shield as we go. Uh, I'm trying to remember where the last one is, actually. Oh, I remember where it is. Okay, uh, okay, the dog's getting fed. Maxie, you working on that? Yeah. Do you have a- do you have Jug? Yep. Alright, here, let me- here, let me- Killing because I needed a little bit more for Jug. Ow! I don't know what I was thinking there. 
Uh, Jug is like weirdly glitching. Is it supposed to be doing that? Yeah, so um, it's supposed to be kind of like ghostly. Um, this map uh, uses a lot of themes of like purgatory and hell and stuff. So I'm uh, probably not going to get Jug until next round. That's all right. Uh, let's just do that. Uh, and Chris, when you got the chance, can you open this door here? Uh, and I don't, uh, no one has an Affleck charge, right? No. All right, the last thing we'll do uh, in this round is I'm going to find the last piece for the shield in here, if I can. Uh, I got it. Oh, you got it? All right, so we can build that actually right uh, over there. I can, I can grab this guy if you want. Come here. Come here. Hang on, he's done. There we go. All right, cool. So, oh, shield now. Excellent. And the shield's really cool because when you open it up, you like put a key in it. It's like no point, but it's kind of like it looks really cool. I like how they make, gave a unique shield to this map. All right. Um. So I guess we can just kill the zombie to get more charges now. Wait, wait. Should we put it on that? Oh, huh? Okay. What? Oh, on the, the dodge. dodge. Oh, that's fine. We'll get enough this round anyway. Um. Oh, I need it. I need a max ammo. Holy shit. Uh, go get the Tommy gun at the back. Over oh, there. yeah, yeah, you're right. That's a really good one. I have the, the Uzi. I really like that one. Uzi's one good, too. Favorite. Yeah. I also like the Uzi because there's like a lot of different wall buys for it around the map, so you can always get ammo for it. Right. You guys can handle the, the dog down there. Yeah. So you get a couple more points for a uh, jug. Oh, literally just get the good. one. <laughs> so, so you killed the guy next to Well, it's like we still have to get the last dog anyway, which is going to be a pain in the dick. Holy shit. The last dog is uh, very uh, tight. Uh, so we can actually go up to the... Uh, actually, we need to do the last uh, afterlife thing here, which I'll do. But after that, we should uh, take the gondola up to get back to the top of the map. Is the uh, the box is in uh, the warning's office? I don't think it was. I didn't see it there. It could. I think it might be in the cafeteria. Oh shit! Hopefully that doesn't end the round. Um, I need to find a box. I think there's one in here. So I'm gonna use this box here, and there will be three glowing generators in this room. I'm gonna zap all three of them, and that will turn off that electric door that was up in the warden's office, so we can get the part that's up there. Um, so there's one there, and then one in here. Hope, I don't know if that spawns a Brutus, but it might. Should uh, I open this door down here? Uh, no, you don't need to do that. We're, let's, uh, let's all get up to the con the gondola right now, so we can take okay. that back up. The gondola! Take Next the Wakanda up. back up. Next to you. Alright, there's still a zombie there. Let's go. You're eating my dust, slow pokes. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah. I'll. I say smell you later, but you already smell yourself. Yep. Yep. Uh, so you both still have your afterlifes, so we can use those. But first, we need to get up to the roof because we all, all three of us have uh, pieces that we need to put on. Um, your hairline's atrocious. Uh huh. So go this way. Just open this shortcut, uh, Chris, if you can do that. Get the fuck out the way. <laughs> bit tight. Bit <laughs> get the fuck tight. Out. Um, and then we can go through the cafeteria if you want. That'd be kind of fun. Uh, yep, the box is in there, and I love the box design on this map. It's like a straight out of hell. And there's some cool wonder weapons on this, or not wonder weapons, uh... Mini gun! Dual, dual 5-7. <laughs> yeah, the death machine is on here. Uh, and Chris, if you can open up the, uh, next area. It's over here, right? Uh, no, it's up here. Of course, oh, that's where it's bearing the barrier. Okay. Where? Uh, right there. Oh, right here. Okay. Yep. So this will take us up towards the roof. Uh, uh, watch, uh, watch the zombie. Try for one more gun. Okay. Uh, Max, you can come uh, get open the roof for us. You can get up here. Alright. So, we're not opening that door. We're going to go this way. And, Max, I'd like you to... Oh, I'm going to open this up. Uh, Max, you can use the Afterlife box here. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Over there on the wall, on the right of this room. Big room oh, in here. Right, I right see. there. And yeah. you're going to come back the way we came. Which way I'll kind of lead you over here, and you should see a an open door here. No, no, over here, Max. Uh, okay. Yeah, go to there. Yep, open door there. So you're going to climb up there onto the roof. Whoa. 
Okay. And then uh, come back towards the door over here where my name is. There you go. And then come down and turn on Deadshot while you're here. And that's it. So you can get yourself up. Uh, so let's go up and put these pieces onto the roof now. And we could actually use the plane this round because we've opened all the parts now. <laughs> there you go. But I kind of want to feed the dog as well. But we probably, maybe we should, I don't know, we can do whatever. Uh, so let's go back and grab this piece, someone. And then we need to get the one from the warden's office. Keep it up, guys. We're nearly done. Put on a plane, Chris. We're getting out of the shindig. Also, let me know if anyone gets a sniper rifle out of the box. Like Will do, Daddy-o. Sure. Alright, so I'm going to start heading back towards the warden's office so I can get the last piece. Why do people say Daddy-o? Daddy-o? I don't know. Oh, snap, Daddy-o. Daddy oh, snap. Daddy Push that fuzz. Everybody I'm not moves dad, to the back baby. of the bus. Uh-huh. Oh, uh, yeah. I think there's another Baby. piece in here that I need as well. Is a spell. Uh, Did someone say minigun? Oh, Galil. Um, Galil's all right. I'll take that. Uh, I don't think I mentioned it, but um, you can uh, you can see that your character's name next to your score on this map, which is kind of cool. Because yeah. the characters are kind of important. I don't think any of us are the weasel, right? I'm, I'm Billy. I'm awesome. You're what? <laughs> I'm Billy. Yeah, Chris is Billy Hanson. Max, who are you? Possum. Awesome. You're the weasel. All right. Um. So yeah, I'm Sal DeLuca. So I'm like the the boss, like the mob boss. Uh, Billy Hanson is uh the uh like the muscle. Like he's the one who does the assassinations and gets the dirty work done. Uh, the one we don't have is Finn O'Leary, who's like the money man. And then uh, the weasels like. The crazy one who <laughs> comes up with all these batshit crazy plans that don't ever work. He's also explosive maker. So we could take the plane if you want, or we could fill up the dog. Last dog. What do you want to do? I've never seen a plane sequence. So. Okay, let's do that. So let's get on the plane. Come on, come on, come on, let's go. Everybody come on, Chris. On now. You've never seen the plane sequence, really? Never. Yeah. It's my first time. I told you guys it would work! <laughs> yeah, the weasel's the one who came up with a plan to build a plane on the roof to escape Alcatraz. I did it, guys! My plane worked! We're going down. Uh, again! One of my favorite parts here is uh, if you look off the side of the bridge, uh, I think it's over here. Maybe. Oh, there it is. You can see the plane going down. <laughs> oh. That's kind of funny. So now we're on the Golden Gate Bridge, and Pack Punch is here, if you have 5,000. Kind of reminds me of that one mission in uh, Payday. Right, yeah, I know what you're talking about. That bridge mission? That was yeah. kind of fun. So we could save up here for uh, Pack. I will warn you, Brutus is going to spawn in here, and there's probably going to be multiple of them spawning. Yep, there, there he is there. Um... Yeah, I didn't, I didn't really finish my explanation earlier, but Brutus, if you don't really engage with him, or if you don't kite him around, he'll go around the map and lock stuff up, and you have to pay 2000 to unlock it. So you can do that with perk machines, you can do that with just doors going between areas, uh, you can do that with the mystery box. Uh, help! Help! Get off! Get off. Oh, Dude, this guy's fucking tough. Holy shit. I can get enough to pack this Uzi. How do you leave here? Uh, you have to go up to those uh, chairs over there. So once we're all ready, I'm gonna get just a few more points and pack, and then we can leave. Same, but I was just asking. <laughs> I'm gonna pack. I'm 500 away. I think I should be able to get that. Uh, do I want to pack Galil? I don't have any bullets in my 5.7s, so maybe I'll do that. I'll pack the Tommy gun. Oh, Brutus is spawning again. That's great. Blast him before he goes crazy. There we go. <laughs> Another one um, spawned. Uh, yep. 
I want a pack, but I need to be protected. Yeah, yeah, this is gonna be a little, little hard. Um. All right, I'm packing. God damn, he's so tough. There no, please don't go down. No. Oh my god, my weapons. Go get it, get it, get it. Did you get Got it? Him. Yep. All right. What about you, Max? I need to pack the. Oh shit. Okay. I'm done. You down? Is Chris down too? Yeah, I'm down. All right. If you can get Chris up first before you get yourself up, that'd be good. I like him up. Uh, maybe you can't get him up. Maybe I'm just completely lying about that. Shit. I'm... I got you. I got How you. I got the you. Fuck. <laughs> the. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right, Max. I will. Oh, ray gun. That's nice. Ray guns. Ah, yeah. Jesus Christ! This is so fucking. This is ridiculous. Oh fuck! I don't know why I just killed that crawler. Let's see if we can make one crawler. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get Max. Oh no! I'm not gonna get him up. Here, I'll make a crawler. No. Oh, shit. All right, Max, pack your gun and then let's get the fuck out of here, please. I don't want to stay here. Do we all just sit on these yeah. at once? Yep. Uh, uh, uh. Alright. There we go. Let's go, let's, let's go, go, let's go. <laughs> he might follow us back to, uh, the prison. Spoiler alert, we're going back to the prison. And now, we're back at the start of the game. So the idea here is that we're basically going through this cycle where the prisoners keep reappearing at the prison, building the plane without any memories of, what, of what's happened. So if you want to go back towards Jug, we can do that, or you can uh, build a plane Jug again. And the shields. We have to wait till the next round to build a plane again. Okay. I also want to. I kind of want to go to the dog room if you guys want to go to the the docks. Because I do want to finish that. So. Um, you can take the gondola. If you get all the way to the top, you can take that down. Okay. Uh, where'd you guys go? I went up towards... Forgetting oh, how to... Max is here. Max is here with me. Oh, we, we went up to the top. So if you go through the cafeteria where the box oh, was... fuck. Where's the gondola? Uh, it's not there, Max. Then why did I come here? I don't know. I... <laughs> I don't you said they take the gondola me. up top. You said it was well, up here! It's up at the top of the cell block, not the top of the roof. You said this is the top! Oh god, I'm about to die. Are you dead? I'm good. Shit. There you go. Cool. Careful, Max. Careful, Max. Careful, 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 careful Max. Careful now. I hope I'm going the right way. There's another one behind you. You should have stayed dead. Okay, is that the last one? Yep. Right. Last zombie? Uh, the last uh, dog head. Oh my god. Oh, okay, I was like... Why are they spawning here? Oh my god. Why did they all just suddenly spawn in at once? Uh, I'm right. down. Chris, I'm coming to get you up. Um, I'm in the like basement area if you basement can. Basement area. Like going down the, the spiral steps. Okay, got it. I should be able to get there. So now that we fed the three dog heads, and while I get. Oh, Max, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get you two. I'll do my best though. Oh my god, Chris, you are so far down there. Holy shit. I thought yeah, you'd be like near the, the top end. of the steps. Oh, uh, nope. Damn it. Alright, I'm not I'm definitely not gonna be able to get Max now, I'm sorry. Um Luckily we have a good amount of points. I'm gonna let them break my shield so I can get a new one. And then I'm gonna go get the uh the reward for our dog hunting. Whew. Yeah, this is the kind of hectic experience you get when you uh when you go through the rounds willy nilly, which is expected to happen. Um But uh 
a dead piece of shit now. What? Some folks gotta learn the hard way. Okay. Um, so I'll try and spawn you guys down here so you can get Jug, or would you rather be near the mystery box? Jug. Jug, okay. Because I can just buy the Tommy gun off the wall. Right. True. True. Is Jug not at the bottom? It is, but I'm gonna go get the, uh, the, the, the special thing. Since we've gotten all the dog heads, we can go over here. And pick up, boom, the health retriever. And this thing is a badass. Yeah. So, the health retriever is a tomahawk that you can throw. And uh, it takes up your alt grenade slots, like where monkey bombs would go. You can hold it to charge it up, and it'll it'll bounce through more zombies if you hold it. I just ended the round, sorry. Uh, it's this way, guys. Um... It is, uh, you just have to wait for it to recharge, so it's basically infinite. Uh, you can just keep throwing it. Uh, and it can also pick up power-ups from long range. So let's grab that while we're here. Yeah, the, the round after you get back to the prison, the, uh, the parts will spawn back in. Except you don't have to do all the puzzles to get them. So here's Jug. And Max, I'll take you to the, uh, the Tommy gun, because you probably want to grab that first. I'm grabbing the, uh, shield back here. Right. Yeah, make sure you grab that. Up. And someone pick up the uh, the part here if you get the chance. I don't know if I get the chance yet. <laughs> All right. Oh, we're probably crossing don't paths too much. Here. We probably don't want to stay here. Ooh. And throw the tomahawk. And Brutus is coming. There is an insta kill near the stairs going back up if someone wants to grab that. Okay. I'm gonna call the gondola if you guys want to take that back up. Okay. I probably want to kill Brutus while uh while the insta He's kill on is me? up. Alright, I'm coming back in. I'm gonna jug. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Off the cheesy. One thing you can do is activate this uh, tower trap. I'm at the gondola. I'm being trapped by Brutus. Whew. There we go, he's dead. Nice. Alright. So yeah, you can activate that trap and the, the sniper up in that tower will, st will shoot the zombies, which is kind of funny. That's cool. Uh, and you, uh, one thing you can do with all the traps in this map is you can go into afterlife mode and shock them to upgrade the traps. That one, uh, he'll start firing RPGs instead of sniper rifles. And we are out of here. Oh! Oh my god, one thing we need to do. Uh, we can't end this round, uh, because there's a really cool thing that is on this map. Because there is, of course, a wonder weapon, uh, aside from the health retriever. Uh, I'm gonna use my afterlife to turn on, uh, electric cherry while we're here. Because that's a new perk on this map, and I want to show it off. Uh... Wherever it is, because I can't find it. There it is. Alright, so. I'm by Electric Cherry. Oh god. Oh god. So Electric Cherry, what it'll do is, every time you reload, you will produce an electric shock. And that electric shock's power is proportional to the amount of ammo you have missing in your clip. So if you have a completely empty clip and you're reloading, you'll do a maximum charge electric shock. That'll stun all the zombies around you and give you some time to reload. So it's a really good perk. Especially you couple with speed cola. Yeah. Uh, especially with the wonder weapon on this map, which I'll hopefully be able to show off at the end of this round, assuming we don't end it. Um... So what I'm going to do while we're here is I'm going to start this little thing. So you can... Uh, th there's, still, there's still more zombies. There's one in there. Alright, we'll try and make a zombie here. Boop! There we go. Okay, feel free to kill all the ones that aren't crawlers. Yeah, jump down there. I might have killed the crawler, I'm not sure. No, there's like two or three crawlers here. I'm actually, we gotta kill all these zombies. Yep. 
I really love the health retriever. It feels so good. Oh, nice. There we go. Okay, cool. There's a lot of fucking zombies. Yeah, this map's really hectic. It's so tight. Like, all the- everything is really tight on this map. Um, uh, no, Max, we're gonna- You're just ducking me. Careful. Like, you guys alright? <laughs> yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, we're yeah. fine. Okay. So, okay, so, yeah, like I said, you can get the, um... If one of you wants to come to the Warden's office and pick up the part in there, that'd be cool. Um, Where is it? It's in the oh. Warden's office in that cage in there. Uh, I'll grab Speak Hollow while I'm here as well. So, yes, you can get the Wonder Weapon out of uh, the Wonder Weapon oh, out of the mystery box, but you can also do this little quest where you pick up these invisible skulls with the what health retriever, it? and you can see them. Is this the last zombie? I think so. Okay, I'll try and crawl them. Oh, um, there's more. There's the crawls are over here. Okay. Or there's one over here. All right. So, yeah, you can uh, you can see those skulls if you're in afterlife mode, but the they always they're always in the same location. So if you know where they are, you can uh, you can always just get them uh, without going into afterlife mode to check, which is really nice. I'm glad they did that. Um, so I'm gonna go around and collect them if I remember where they are. I think one is in, down here, or is it in there? I think it might be in here. I think that skull has one. No, it's the other one. Alright. I always get this wrong. It's this one, I think. There we go. Uh, so there's five in total, and I'm gonna go around and collect them all. And then, if you collect all five of them, you get a free wonder weapon. Which is really nice. Uh, so I'm just trying to remember the quickest way to do this. Uh, let's get there's the a part in the showers too, if you guys. Uh, right, right, right. I'll, anybody have free spot? We're, I'm heading to the roof now, right now, so I'll put my part up there when I get there. Um, so one thing while I'm going around talking about this, uh, I can talk about the uh, my biggest complaint about this map, which I've probably talked about on video before, but whatever. Um, this map for some reason only has uh, five perks on it, which is really weird. Um. I understand why Quick Revive isn't on this map, obviously, but other than that, the five perks you have here are Jug, Quick, uh, Jug, Speed Cola, Double Tap, uh, Electric Sherry, and Deadshot. And funnily enough, this this map is actually the first map that Deadshot appears in in uh, Black Ops 2, which is nice. Is someone minding the crawler? Um, no. Okay. Hopefully that doesn't bite us in the ass. Um, one, two, three. Four, five. I need to get the one, both of the ones in the docks. Right, I'm going down, back down to the docks. Where's Speed? Speed is in the warden's office. Yeah. Um, okay. So yeah, like I was saying. Um, I can grab this while I'm here. We're cooking now. I found another. Uh, so yeah, you get the. Oh, and you guys can also come pick up a uh, health retriever if you want from the. Uh, I got one. Shower. Okay. What's that? It's, um, if you remember the shower room where early on where we fought the first Brutus, it's just past there. Uh, so, yeah, you only get those five perks, and I just find it really odd that they don't have Mule Kick and Stamina Up on this map, because I think if they just add those two, then it'd be great, because Stamina Up, this map's fucking huge, and Stamina Up would be really nice. They do, it is a pretty well-designed map in that they have a lot of shortcuts everywhere that help you get around, but, um, I just find it really weird that they don't have Stamina Up. Uh, and then Mule Kick, obviously, like, I think... Most maps do that mule kick. What was that? That's the uh, box moving. Oh, okay. That's dope. It's like a lock. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Ugh, I'm missing. Um, just trying to make this uh, Hell's Retriever shot to get the skull. Eh. Fuck. <laughs> um, yeah, so one one thing uh, you can get out of the box is the Death Machine, which is normally a power up, but you can just get it as a weapon on this map. And you can even. You can even. Uh, Pack it. Wow. Which is pretty, pretty nice. Cool. Pretty good. <laughs> there we go. Finally got it. Looks like just what we were looking for. And uh, again, if you see a sniper rifle from the box, make sure to grab that. Uh, what else? Uh, I can also show off down here at the docks. You can, uh, uh the, the box is at the docks, by the way. Uh, you can, uh, yeah. look at, you can look out and see the PhD flopper machine over there on the boat and the mule kick machine. It's like, you know, it'd be nice to have those. Uh, and I think it's that one. Yep, there we go. So I have all five now. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and try and spin the box here. Just once. Sure. Sweet looking business box. Okay, so I'm heading back up to the warden's <laughs> office now, because that's where I can get the free 
uh, wonder weapon. And then we can end the round when we're ready. Uh, if you want, we can go to the, uh, go do the launch sequence again to go back to the bridge, unless you guys just want to spend your time here uh, trying to get perks. Yeah, let me try to uh, get some points, and then... All right. but I'm trying to go to a box, but I don't really... So you Where's could take the, the gondola, um, okay, there go. or you could go through the showers, yeah. Max, did you get your health retriever? Yes. Okay, good. So is the plane, like, already built, too? And they just don't remember how the plane got built? Uh, I think that's just for gameplay. I think the idea is that they're building the plane every time, but for gameplay, mm. it's just you have to refuel it. Uh, oh, hi. Do we really want this thing crawling around? Ow. All right. Alright, almost there. And I should probably pick up double tap, which I don't think we have. Uh, we, I don't think we ever actually turned that on. Max, do you have a. No, it's, it's turned on. Oh, it is? It's turned okay. on. Yeah. Well, I wasn't sure. Alright, so when I walk in here, you'll see a fire on the desk, and out of the desk will come the wonder weapon. I'm coming for you, except a so, this is the Blundergat. It is a Blunderbuss Gatling gun combination. Uh, and it is ridiculous. It's absolutely insane how fucking crazy this thing is. Um, it is, uh, it only has one shot in the chamber, uh, but it hits a really wide area and it hits, uh, it kills everything in this area really easily. Um, and because it only has one shell in the chamber, that means it works really well with, a. Uh, um, electric cherry, cherry yeah. Because every time you fire it, you'll get a full charge electric shock around you. Uh, and the other really cool thing about this uh, gun is that you can upgrade it uh, in kind of three different ways. Uh, you can pack punch it, obviously, which will turn it into the sweeper. Um, and the other thing you can do is you can pick up all the pieces of the acid gat kit, which I have two of now. I'm trying to remember where the third one is, looking at my map. And of course I didn't write it down, but I should be able to find it eventually. Um, oh, did Brutus lock our, uh, he locked our riot shield? Oh, did he? It's on fire and it says 2000. Yeah, so. yeah he did. What a dick. <laughs> um, let's turn that on again at some point. Uh, I'm ready to end the round whenever you guys are. I don't know what, what um, you guys want to do. Uh, to go to a roof, I gotta use the gondola? Uh, that's one way you could go. Um, where are you right now? At the gondola, but at the bottom. It's uh, like ducks. So you could call it and ride it to the top. That'll cost you 750 or you could uh, just go up the long way through, like, the spiral stair and stuff. Um, okay. And then how do I get to, like, the actual roof part? Uh, you have to go... You can go through the cafeteria and then up the stairs from there. Or if you're in, like, the cell block area, you can, like, run past Electric Sherry, and that'll take you through a passageway to get there. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try and find the last acid get piece while we're doing this because I have uh, I just looked it up. Um, desk outside the spawn is near the athletic box and cafeteria, and under the stairs near the warden's office. All right, let me check the cafeteria. What the fuck did I get here? I will. Bruh. Also, I'm gonna. I might as well use my last little bit of money. Hmm. Don't think it's here. A fucking RPG. Yeah, it <laughs> it's a classic. Um, so yeah, one thing I I just love about this map is that just keep, when you compare it to Transit and Die Rise, it just feels so much more player friendly, but it still retains kind of the challenge that <clears throat> you kind of want to see in this kind of game mode. Um, is it here? No. Is it here? No. Is it around here? No. It must be under the stairs. Very bad at finding this last piece. This one piece of the acid get kit's the one that's always really tough. Um, maybe... Ah, son of a bitch. I just can't fucking find this thing. I'm awful. Uh, so to go through... Okay. So I gotta go through the showers and go up, right? Um, if you're coming up from the docks, yeah, go through the showers and then turn into the cafeteria. Oh, okay, wait. Oh, I think I went the other way. It's I'm at the warden's office. Somewhere. But where? 
Hey, none of you got it, right? Yeah. <laughs> Top of a desk just has a spawn by a jail cell. It's it's not. I know for a fact it's not. It's on one of those normally. I think it might be in the cafeteria and I just missed it. Shame. I just keep hearing fucking the weasel just <laughs> talking to the zombie down there. <laughs> it's gotta be in here. So the showers look like something out of like manhunt. It's pretty scary. <laughs> I think uh, they did a really good job making this map look like you're you know, you're in hell. Do I go through the infirmary? Like go up through the infirmary to get Uh yeah, through the infirmary to get to the roof. Okay. Where the hell is this last piece? I'm, I'm honestly stumped. I, I'm normally, normally can get this, but I'm just not doing well. Um, what is the piece? Do you know? It's a, uh, it's like a case for this thing. Um, and I just, it's just a. Uh, Whatever. We, we, I think we we will have to do a uh, part two um, this because there's even more stuff on this map. One thing that's going to become kind of consistent with these maps is that they're just going to keep adding more and more and more like little Easter eggs and content. Like we still have to, you know, get the uh, the golden spork is a thing we can try and get. Um, if I can't figure out the ask yet thing here, I want to do that. And um, the third way you can upgrade is by doing both pack punching it and getting putting it through the ask get kit. And that'll give you the uh, the vitriolic withering, which is a very very good wonder weapon. Um, but uh, yeah, are we gonna? What are we, what's our plan, by the way? Um, finish that thing of the plane. I just put the last thing on. All right, I'm coming to the roof. All right, I'm gonna take one last look in the. Uh, I'm gonna take one last look downstairs just to make sure I didn't miss it. Unless we're all here already. Max, where are you at? Heading towards... Okay, we'll just go then. I can always pack it first and then ask and get it later. It, the thing also has a lot of ammo. It has 60 shots in total, which is nice. Alright, you guys ready? Yep. Busy? Are we, like, flying? I don't know. It's up to you guys. Hell yeah. I'm already kitted out. <laughs> okay. Let's get the hell out of here, now! I knew it! It worked! <laughs> Look at that gun. It's pretty great. My plans always work! <laughs> I hope we don't even like sit on the inside of this wing like that. <laughs> it doesn't right have an inside! <laughs> right on the wings. It's the worst, the worst okay. place! We're flying into a storm! <laughs> All right. No yeah. one gets out alive. Ah, uh, achievement. Oh no! Guys, no. uh, <laughs> this is the upper. No one escapes alive. Right. It's four bodies. Oh no, it's five. That—that's the name of either the. Ch I think that's the name for the achievement on the remake of this map in Black Ops Four. I think I could be wrong about that. Do they add anything on the remake? Oh yeah, all the Black Ops Four remakes are very different than the original maps. So, I'm going to blast Brutus in the face and just one-shot him. <laughs> or two-shot him, I guess, because you have to take off his helmet first. Um, but yeah, this gun is just so fucking good, and I love how they just gave you a way of getting it without having to rely on box lock. It's really, it's really good. <laughs> Shit. Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> I was tabbed out and I fucking nearly died. Oh, my shield's broke. Don't do that. Help. Um, Alright, where you at? Where you at? In the, next to the, uh... 
What? No. Oh, you're over here. Okay. Almost actually went down to that. Uh, Chris, do you have the ray gun? I do. Uh, I'm about to pack. Can you, uh, cover me? Yes. Alright. I'm going up. Alright, and this is the oh, super. Oh god! <laughs> so now it has two shots. This is, uh, <clears throat> nice. Attack me. Gotcha. Also, it has uh, this like cool dog uh, thing on the front. Yeah, here. What's your pack? Uh, the the Tommy gun. Oh well, you don't have jug, right? Nope. Right, shall we? All right. Yep. You can always come back. <laughs> There's a really annoying achievement that I don't have, where you need to have Brutus go around and lock every single thing on the map. <laughs> I'm like, I would never want to do that. That sounds like the worst fucking thing ever. Okay, let me see if I can find this fucking part. I... Nice. I'll help you get Jug. Hopefully. It's definitely not there. Another 800, 800 there. We can also get there's a max ammo in there if we want to open that up with a afterlife mode. So let me know if you ever need a max ammo. Yeah. Alright. Yes, this gun is so fucking fun. If you ever if we do another game at some point, uh I think one of you should take it. Uh I'm down Z's. Because I remember on Die Rise I was the only one who ever got the slick of fire. Um, I guess I'll get double tap. I didn't know why I wanted it last, but... It's basically, do you nice. want Deadshot? <laughs> yeah. Beyond that, you don't really get a choice in your perk selection. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is so fucking... This is good. Oh, it's, it feels so good to play a really good zombie map. It's the funny the audio, because I can hear you through, like, the walls. <laughs> It sounds yeah. so distant. Double tap 2.0. Oh, okay. I accidentally I forgot you can uh you can get the uh power ups out of those jail cells with the health retriever. I accidentally picked it up. That's a whoopsie. Is it one of the Oh, it's right uh, there. Did someone I'm just dumb. use it? Oh, the box. Damn, I, was, I, I took a long way around, and I was like, yeah, let me go get the box. Alright, so I'm going to upgrade my uh, sweeper into the vitriolic withering now. Because I finally found the part. I finally remembered where it was. I'll build it here. Oh, God. Looks like something goes in here. Don't ask me why. But there we go. Vitriolic Withering. So now it becomes a, uh, basically it becomes a monkey bomb thrower that has uh, 150 monkey bombs in store. <laughs> Actually, no, it's more like 50 <laughs> monkey bombs. Um, oh, so it's like the, uh, kind of like, like the bow and arrow. It's kind of like the crossbow, yeah. But yeah, it shoots three little acid things that the zombies get attracted to. I need to get a new shield. Um, and, uh, they'll just blow up. And it has so much ammo, and it's ridiculous. You aren't immune to your own explosions, which is something to consider, but it's not that big of a deal. Um, oh, oh yeah, you can unlock the shield. Yeah, do you, I, I have enough money. I'm coming down, because I need one as well. Uh, I mean, I could do it. I got 6k. Okay. So can... I wasn't sure if you were there. I kind of forgot about it. There you go. Thank you. Uh, here, while we're doing this, let me look at my notes to see what else we can talk about. Um, so yeah, we need to, when we do a, a, uh, a part two, oh yeah, getting a sniper would be good. Um, uh, I kind of want to show off the other traps as well, because there's the, a couple more traps that we haven't used on the map. I used the sniper one earlier. Um, we looked at the gondola, we haven't gotten the death machine, but I already talked about how it's a thing. Uh, I already talked about upgrading traps. Um, I'm gonna spin the box a couple times. You guys can end the round. Wait, you where want. is it? 
Uh, it's uh, up the stairs, the spiral stairs. Oh, it's yep. at the top of there, there I think. That's what I was looking for. God damn it, I don't want this. Yeah, so uh, next time we're going to want to... You, you can also upgrade the health retriever, which is kind of cool. Uh, this little upgrade quest for it. There's the golden spork, which is a secret melee weapon you can get on this map. Um, there's the Easter egg, obviously, which we're going to tackle, which is a uh, really fun and easy one that we can do. Uh, there's a uh, Galil there. Galil? Yeah. Alright, yo, Brutus! Uh, he's still on me. There we go. Oh, oh my god, he killed me! What the fuck? He just got he mad and you. whacked me! <laughs> yeah. Just gonna start picking up my uh. Gotta pick up all my perks again. Yeah, got a sniper. All right. Um, go ahead and keep a hold of that, and let's get to the end of this round. All right. This is gonna be something I'm gonna have you do, and then I'll just have to cut in like my own footage of it later. But that's okay. Um, it's not in the round. Not in the round. Holy shit. Alright, uh, yeah, so, let's get to the end of this round. Back your ass up! <laughs> How did you fucking hear me? I do, it's like through the walls. It's, it literally sounds like it's outside my headphones. Oh, we also have to do, uh, Easter egg songs as well. There's a lot of stuff we have to do, but... I'm okay, uh, keeping this focused on, like, a just kind of first experience, considering we've lit- oh my god. Oh no! It's all right. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Who's next for my melting gun? <laughs> Who's next for my melting gun? You know, I only know that guy, like the actor, uh, from uh, Little Man. <laughs> he right. was a, like a mafia boss in that. Yeah, I think they got all actors who were uh, famous for playing. The only one I'm actually familiar with is Ray Liotta. Um. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I know where you live. Let's okay. see. Uh, actually, wait, what's that uh, power up over there? So I could just grab that. Oh, it's open. <laughs> okay. Sure. I don't know. I don't know where the last zombie is. So, all right, so come There's up here. Like two on us. Okay. Uh, let's Never go up mind. to the roof, Chris. And I want you to get your sniper rifle out. Right you, yep. I'm gonna keep my ring on now until we get up there. <laughs> sure. Okay, so I want you to come over here, Chris. Sort of around here. And I want you to uh, look at... Where are you? Up there. I want you to look at the... Zoom in on the fireworks of the sniper rifle. Oh! <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> um, so yeah, what I probably just put in there... I'll probably just cut it in. Is uh, One thing this map starts introducing is uh, jump scares. <laughs> Which you can easily get by zooming in on something with a sniper rifle. Uh, I'm gonna go get another weapon. <laughs> Wasn't that worth it? Yeah, it was. I dropped uh, I dropped a good weapon for that. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Uh, what else was I doing? Um, I don't remember what else. Was oh yeah, I need to get my all my fucking perks. That's right. <laughs> Wait, are you? That. You don't have anything? I have Jug, and that's it. Oh. I really wanted to. I really wanted you to see that jump scare. That's good. Max, what are you doing? Uh, I have full perks again. Oh, nice. So you've been doing well. I'm just trying uh, to get back to the roof now. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, so they had a new, as you guys might have seen, they had a new like pack punch uh, kind of filter on the guns. Not filter, but like. The guns have the guns will be like glowing orange, kind of, to match the aesthetic of the map. Um, this map introduced the Uzi, the Tommy gun, and also the AK, the AK-74 or the AK-47 rather from the box you can get. Um, it's the only map, only zombies map you can get that gun, even though it's like a really like that gun is in like basically every Call of Duty game. Um, if you pack it, it, it becomes the uh, the Reznov's Revenge, which is a reference to the campaign mode. I got another sniper. Oh, you want to try again? <laughs> um, 
I have enough for double tap, but that's alright. I keep getting right. the same weapons, what the fuck? Come on, right, go to the roof. I need one more fuel. Uh, yeah, I have it. Perfect. Coming up. Guess we're taking the plane again. Apparently. Uh, let's see, what else? What else, what else was? Uh, in the opening cutscene, which I played at the beginning, you, hopefully if it didn't get copyright fucking claimed or whatever, um... You, uh, one of them says that the one of the times that they're working with on the operation is uh, 935, 935, ha ha ha, funny. Um, if you go to the cafeteria, you can look at a clock in there and it'll, it's 1.15 p.m. or a.m., whatever the fuck, it's 1.15, 1, 1, 1.15 o'clock, so 1.15. Um, on the loading screen of this map in multiplayer, you can see the golden spork on there, which is kind of cool. Uh, if I ever go back to the warden's office, there's a painting of the Tower of Babel in there, which you can maybe see as a reference to the uh, transit Easter egg. Um, tch -tch 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 -tch. Um, the escape sequence that we're performing here is based off of uh, 1962 Escape from Alcatraz by Frank Morris and Company, which uh, was recently featured in the hit TV show Loki Season 2. No? Nothing? Alright. <laughs> wait, 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 what? What was, uh... Featured? The uh, fucking Casey from Loki, he, in like his original life, he was Frank Morris, who escaped from Alcatraz. And, like, oh, yeah, right, that right, in gotcha. one of the episodes in scene two. I remember. Um, let's see, we talked about the gondola. So, yeah, I think uh, that's all that's left is getting the Hell's Redeemer. Uh, music Easter eggs we have to do um, in the opening one. In the opening cutscene, there was a uh, Rusty Cage by Johnny, Johnny uh, Cash, which will be. Uh, yeah, that's a, a music key strike you can do on the map, but we'll probably do that in the next one. Um, there's also the Easter the egg. Yeah, me too. Um, you can also do a couple more music Easter eggs by punching in certain numbers on the uh, that thing in the spiral staircase area. Um, and uh, there's also uh, the return of grief mode on this map that we can get. Are we taking the plane or what? Max, where are you? Yeah. I'll try to get to the the top, I'm sorry. Alright. Oh, god. Take the gauntlet. Is he dead? I think he's dead. Oh, oh no, nope, he's not. not. He's on me. <laughs> eh, take that. Alright, got him. I got him with the, uh, the retriever. That's a pro tip, that the health retriever is really good against Brutus. Just yeah, I was holding mine too. <laughs> It's also a great way to saving ammo. Just like toss that instead. Fire oh, oh, nice. Is there something on here on uh, the roof? Maybe. Is this one over here? No. <laughs> oh wait. Fuck. Oh no, I don't think that's one. Okay. Okay. It might be. I'm pretty sure there's one in the infirmary if you want to go down there. I'm yeah. coming. I have to hit that because I do not have a secondary weapon. Oh, here it is. Alright, gondola. I bet it from here, where I go to get another sniper. I've been getting the same weapons. This is so crazy. Where are you at, Max? And I can't even get another oh, weapon. Gondola. How do I get to the roof from here? Uh, so go from the gondola uh, forward and then turn where you see electric cherry. Go past the electric cherry machine and go all the way to the end. That should take you to the hallway where you can go up the stairs through the infirmary. That makes sense? Yep. Oh my god, Chris. What's up? Brutus locked the plane. <laughs> What? <laughs> oh, of course you did. There we go. I'm here. What a cuck. Right. I wish you stayed home Better today, huh? I wish you stayed home today, actually put this on. There we go. Can I ask you to tech us up here? Nope. No, oh, sir. Uh, what else do we got? That's actually... Oh, there is one thing we could do before we end this video, actually. It's just kind of a, a neat thing. Uh, a neat little Easter egg we can look at, because it's really quick. I'm just going to run around with the uh, the vitriolic withering. I don't know why, but a lot of zombies YouTubers call it the vitriolic withering, and vitriolic is not a word. And it is very clearly, if you read it, vitriolic. I thought it was vitriolic. Vitriol, I guess, yeah, I mean, the the root word is vitriol, so, but, I don't know. Whatever the case, it's not vitrolic, or vitrolic. 
Take this! You like that, Chris? <laughs> Captain America! <laughs> Captain America! Hiya! Oh god. I need help. Uh, yeah, that's unfortunately. My shield go down again? What the fuck? Catch next. Down also. All right. All right. Back it. All right. Let's get out of here. Yeah. All right. You've been sentenced to the chair. Ah! Brutus spawned back in. I got some bad news for you, because here comes Brutus. <laughs> hey, achievement. <laughs> oh yeah, he got an achievement for uh, doing the, the route three times. Oh, I, yeah. it. I thought you had to do that for the uh, for the Easter egg, so you should have it already, Max. Yeah, that's weird. I got the I got the withering, Max. With you. Actually, wanna, I'm gonna go get a double tap, actually, so you're on your own. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> God, we're on 18 on our first try. That's pretty cool. Um, I'm dead. Nah, <laughs> wouldn't be worth it trying to get the. Uh... Oh shit. I'm gonna have to need help, Chris. Uh, should be. I uh, might need help. Where are you? Oh no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm just gonna zap them away. Ooh. Oh god. Uh, what I need actually is uh, another shield. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Chris, I'm not near you, so. <laughs> I know, I know. Should be fine, I should be Jeez, fine. That was fucking loud. My ears are ringing like a church bell. Uh, oh god, no! Mm -hmm. uh, no! Let's see, uh, I think you I'm, can get I'm, there. No, I'm going to the docks. I'm going to the docks. Oh, okay. Are you, on the, the are you on the gondola? <laughs> Your body's on the fucking gondola. Well, lucky for you, I'm literally right here. Same. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. So I, I, for some reason, I had the idea Pro that um, you could use afterlife mode to resurrect your friends, but I'm not sure if that's actually a thing. Now, now that I'm thinking about it, what am I doing here? I am getting the shield. Making use of your uh, health retriever mix. Trying to. That was me. Yeah, I'm just asking Max. Oh god! Oh god! I gotcha, I gotcha. There's so many! <laughs> oh, I kind of forgot where fucking Jug is. Uh, yep, go this way. Then up the stairs. Up the stairs, okay. Yep, and that's on your left. Okay, thank you. Oh my god, I got right here. Thanks. Thanks. I was getting bored. Nice, I needed that. Same. Insta kill. Insta kill. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Alright, Max. Yep. What's this little cage area? Is that uh, doing anything? Where? It's just where you get like a, a piece, I assume, like equipment. Oh, the part of the bottom of the spiral stairs? Yeah. Yeah, that's where you got the, uh, that piece. Sir? That's where you go to die. Because <laughs> there's no way out of there. It's like Alcatraz. Oh, uh, I'll go ahead and look at the, uh, the traps that we haven't looked at before we, uh, hit this. The story goes is like those three guys actually did escape, right? I don't know for sure. I don't know honestly. <laughs> it's either they es they actually escaped or they they died horribly in the waters trying. I cannot tell you what actually happened because I'm not knowledgeable enough about it. All right, <laughs> getting the parts again. <laughs> yep, we're almost to we're almost done with the Easter egg. Technically, we could literally finish the Easter egg right now. <laughs> That's the funny thing. <laughs> but I want to do it with uh with four people. Gotcha. What the f yo. 
All right, so I'm going to turn on the acid trap here. So this just rains acid down and kills the zombies. <laughs> this is pretty, pretty cool to look at. Pretty, it's, it's really fucked up. Like everything in this map is just like all fucked up. And I, I, I kind of love that. <laughs> oh, it hurts me too. The acid. Yeah. Oh, that's upsetting. As, as do most traps. Yeah. Yeah, for some reason I was like, oh, maybe not this one. <sighs> maybe I'm just built different. Yeah. <laughs> I can take it. Jeez, that was fucking loud. I used a ring like a church bell. Oh, what the hell? Split up like the Fourth of July. Oh no, I fucking switch for the fail. Uh, not a goat weapon. <laughs> Max, he just put in the. Are you fueling the plane again? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Got a fuel can. I don't know which ones you've gotten. The one on the docks and the one that's like right before the plane. Okay, so there's still the warden's office one. I just got the shower room, and there's the uh, um, one at the, the bottom of the stairs. Oh, I shouldn't have got that. That was ramp. Dumb. I don't know why we keep calling it stairs. It's like ramp, I guess. How the fuck did that guy not die? What the fuck? A mistake. I'm okay. Oh my god, this fucking retriever is just not <laughs> in it. Uh oh, I need uh, max ammo. Holy shit! <laughs> I almost died. I hit T to talk, which is not ideal. Huh. Yeah, I think the, the health retriever is actually falling off. <laughs> so, this would have been the time where it would have been nice to have upgraded it, but I think we're beyond the point where that's feasible. Oh my god, I'm at the top. I'm of the line. prison, not roof, but like uh, the actual the cell sale. Block. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Um, one of the steps to upgrading the uh, the Hell's Retriever is to uh, spend an entire round on the Golden Gate Bridge and only kill zombies with the Retriever. And at this point, I don't think that's feasible. Oh, there's another thing um, that you can do, Chris. If you wanna watch out. Come with me. Also, uh, if you see this uh, this kind of pit of lava down here, you can throw grenades into that, and each one gives you 25 points, or 20 points rather. Oh shit! So that's just like a way you can get points every round, I guess, if you're really desperate. It's not really useful, but it's just kind of a neat thing. Uh. God damn it! Oh my god! Uh oh. Fuck me. I don't know if you can get me, really. I have uh, a ray gun. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. You just got Humpty Dumpty. All right. I am no leaving. My shield broke again. <laughs> I keep fucking breaking my shield. Oh, man. Uh, they did take uh, out the, uh, the feature of um, being able to put down your shield. I was on transit. Which is fine. Because who used that? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Max, you want to take the gondola with me, or are you good? Uh, I'm heading to the docks. Yeah, that's what, okay. Let me start thinking <laughs> about uh, wrapping this up, by the way. Because. Getting close to the time where Chris needs to go? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, uh, Bree said she'll be done around 7 30, so. Uh, okay. Can go a little longer then. I just want to leave a little bit of time at the end to uh, show you one last Easter egg. That was the last guy. Oh, shit. Oh, that's the guy behind me. How'd, how'd the one's high? How'd How the one spawn in front of me? Good. I'm here to get a shield. Is the gondola here? Yeah. Alright. Oh, yeah, I usually go down there. I'm, I'm taking it with you. Hold on. Uh, oh, wait. I, went the wrong way. Yeah, I was gonna say, where, I wonder where he's gonna go <laughs> get down there. He's gonna turn on the, the sniper the... tower? <laughs> Sorry.
Let's get this fucking gondola moving. Let's get this fucking gondola moving. Blow up, you. Jeez, that was fucking loud. My ears are ringing like a church bell. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, that was fucking loud. <laughs> <laughs> Just following you guys. I don't really have anything I need Probably to do. Probably shouldn't do that. I have a fail. It's not really doing. I mean, much. I have the vitriolic withering. I think we're fine. I I like the music kind of sting that plays when you go to the infirmary. I don't know what it is, but it's just like. Ar, ar, ar. Did you just pick up Deadshot, Max. So yeah, why not? I don't know. I mean, kind of ground what I see. I'm not too concerned. Ah, only one of you. Uh, that might be the one at the bottom of the stairs, unless that's the one you picked up there. Picked up. So is it the? Is that? Do you say that's the one you picked up? I think so. All right, that's probably the warden's office. Yep. So you're starting to kind of get the uh, get the layout here. A little bit, yeah. This one, this one, this map like took me so long. It's it's mainly just the cell block, honestly. Like the cell block kind of looks very. Uh, it, it still confuses me. Um, that's one of the big reasons why I didn't play uh, Mario Day. I thought I really like this map, like at atmospherically. Mm -hmm. uh, that was hard. Um, I really <laughs> like this map for that, but um, I always like stayed away from it because I like couldn't learn it to save my life. Yeah, it's it's very like I think the Blundell maps are very much like. They're, they're very overwhelming, but once you actually kind of, like, get in and learn them, learn the layout, and also, like, obviously learn the, uh, the pack punch process, and, you know, uh, basically, basically the setup, the setup process is what it kind of boils down to, uh, they're just so fun, <laughs> like, they become so, so enjoyable, and that's what you get with, uh, Shadows of Evil, um, Origins to some extent, and just all, all the Black Ops 3 maps, really, um, I don't know. Do anybody know where uh, boxes? I don't. It was in the wars. Is it where? Warden's office. Oh, okay. I, I know. I pa we passed it while running, Riley. So, it's either the warden's office or the cafeteria, then. I, 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 I. All right, ready to play again. <laughs> yes. I don't know how the plane works on multiplayer. Here, let's try it. Let's try boarding the plane and see what happens. It might just like rip Chris away and like teleport him onto it. I'm not sure. Uh, or we could just go alone. <laughs> All right. See you, Chris. <laughs> See, let's see why Clay keep failing. Get too much weight. It's true. Or uh, maybe not. <laughs> Welcome back. Yeah, it just leaves Chris. Holy shit. That's kind of neat. Basically, the opposite of uh, Area 51 and Moon, where you need everyone to go there together. Those monsters are on the bridge too. Yeah, I guess if if it didn't leave me behind, it was soft lock. Cause like, <laughs> you guys couldn't go down on top of the plane. You can't get off the plane to come get me. So. Well, I I didn't figure that. I just figured it would like teleport you onto us. Gotta use our easier retriever if you can. Ah. Oh god, I need that. Oh my god, the fucking hell streamer does nothing to the zombies now. Oh, that's that's sad. Oh, there you go. Uh what's uh what's the plan here? Why are we here? Uh -oh. Why did we go here? <laughs> I don't. I don't even back. Well, why are we here? Let's leave. We're getting the Easter egg done. You know, this is our fourth time to the Golden Gate Bridge. <laughs> Jeez. Oh my God. Fire sale. Right, I need that. Oh, I also no, want to show no, the no, fan no, no, no. 
Move! God damn. <laughs> My ears are ringing like a church bell. Alright, here we go. This is the last trap. Behold. The fan trap. <laughs> That's a nice one. This is music, you hear that? Yeah. It's bumping. Oh, it's over. Yeah, it's also kinda Blundell's uh Blundell's really good about putting like an actual score into the uh the map beyond the music. I might actually eggs. Go down. Um My favorite being of course Origins, just like everything, but Origins has this just magical score that is so good, especially when you like leave the uh, the bunker and go to no man's land for the first time, and you just get this great little theme where it's like do 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 do. It's like this art, like this German army theme. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> Chris, I'm with you. Okay. I forgot how to get to the warden's office. Uh, go straight. It's on this and side. Right? Yep. Turn left. Oh, that's not it. Oh, that's not Over it. Here. I just stuck one onto you. Whoops. Yeah, I know. I see it in my <laughs> head. It's uh, down there. Thank you. See, this all looks kind of the same to me. That's all yeah. I was like. it's, you just kind of have to play it a bunch, and eventually you'll kind of you'll get it. Speed is in here, too, somewhere, right? Yep. Oh, you got the oh, death machine. There we go. Look at that. Piece of shit now. Boo, boo, boo. <laughs> it's not uh, the sound isn't as satisfying as the uh, the scavenger from Call of the Dead, but it's pretty good. <laughs> Max, what are you up to? I'm on the docks. Nice, good. All, All right, right, boys. Yeah. Let's get some of that fuel. Let's go to the roof. All right, we're going to end it on the roof. All right. Oh, yeah, I want to pack a push the fucking minigun. All right, we'll, we'll try and end it on the roof because we have... We're cooking now. Uh, I, got, the fuel cans. I got the shower one. Next uh, one, what did you get? I got the one in the docks. Okay. Uh, I don't know where... Uh, Chris, this one over there. here. Watch oh. out. <laughs> Turn my back. Sorry, I stuck another one to you. There's one there. It's round 21, and I just feel fucking unstoppable still with this thing. <laughs> like, I just, I just do not give a damn about any of these zombies. <laughs> Call me the weasel. You goons don't stand My head goes pop. Uh, Brutus is here. I don't know Crazy. where he is. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> He's probably gonna be locking shit up. He might be up there somewhere. I'm not sure. Yep. Oh, he is. Oh god. I'm getting the warden's office one, and I think we just need the uh the one at the bottom of the ramp. Got a few cans. What did Brutus say just now? I don't know. He has a bunch of lines. <laughs> There's one at the bottom of the ramp, you said? Yep. Like uh the step stairwell? Yep. Okay. Going to I'm actually going to get that. Hey, do you want to see the acid trap? Sure. Oh, the music. Wow, that's, that's, I think it's whenever you activate a trap that goes off. The tra the, we got traps going here. Music. How long does this last for? Uh, About 30 seconds, maybe. I don't know. Oh no! Alright, what's up? I almost down myself with the ray gun. Ah, shit. 
We got oh, I go. also got don't stuff. have uh, what's the name? Okay, really oh, go grab nerve. that now. I kind of wish I had a gun that wasn't the Uzi still. Man, if Alex has gotten all of us, we could have gotten the Easter egg done all set. This one well, all I kind of want that to be its own video. It'd been the super. That's video, why you cut it. Though. That's why you cut. Eh. Oh God. I really like this being like it. Oh, the gun is not down, down here. Oh, shit. <laughs> You fall! Do you want me to head down there, Chris, and try? No, and... no, I'm good. I'm good. All right. Hopefully. Uh, let's try and make a crawler up here, Max. Okay. I'm gonna make it out of that guy. Gondolas recharging. That does not. Oh my god. Yeah, it takes a little bit. Okay, I can't be in this area then. Crawler? Uh, no, because the grenade just like didn't work. <laughs> oh, god, this... there. Oh. I just killed your crawler. I'm sorry. I was I pulled the pin already. Try try again. There. You got it. Yes. All right. We'll try avoid using the uh, the withering here, because knowing my luck, it's gonna kill that guy. Also, be careful about your electric chair. There's so many zombies inside there. Yeah, on me. <laughs> we got Death Star. We got Death Star. Just leave the face. God. Uh, do we have it all here? Yeah, Chris has the last one. Okay. When does it happen? And when does it end? Time is important, and I am a clock. Hit me! Keep your meat hooks off me. How's it going, Chris? Oh god. Uh, I'm coming guys, slowly. I'm in the infirmary. Infirmary. Oh, you killed the crawler? Yeah. No worries, I'm making them. There's a lot of zombies. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Alright. Hey, right, I feel, feel it. <laughs> Alright, you good? Yep, I'm All on. Right. Good. Nice. Hey! Pardon gift! Here you go! Whee! <laughs> We're home free, boys! We're home Beautiful. free! We did it! This is our fifth time to the Golden Cape Bridge. If you do it enough times, you actually just, like, escape. <laughs> yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, it's Chris. Get out the way. Uh, yeah, let me know what that's called because I don't actually remember. The meat grinder. <laughs> the meat grinder, of course. <laughs> Alright, so let's end it here, I guess. <laughs> we shall. I'll just kill Brutus with that thing. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm waiting till he spawns. He's fucking eating it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. Uh, you wanna go down or you wanna just hit end? Hold on, I wanna see what Electric Cherry does when I waste <laughs> all these bullets. Oh, it's not based on the amount of bullets, it's based on like the percentage of your ammo capacity. Oh, okay. A lot of bruises. I don't remember if his name is actually Brutus. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to just be the Warden, but uh, I think everyone just called him Brutus. It might just be one of those like Leroy kind of things. Yeah. And Ted, where everyone just kind of comes up with a name for him and everyone just kind of accepts it. But it might be, that might actually be canon somewhere. I don't actually remember. It's like a helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all out of blues. Alright. You're completely out of that thing. Yep. yep. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
You know how many bullets that fucking Brutus took? I guess, yeah. I'm starting to run out of this, uh... This wonder weapon. Okay, we're almost done massive ammo. My only backup is a fucking Uzi. It's the one room challenge. The back rooms challenge. Yeah. It's, it's a pretty good play. Like if you're, if you're on solo, it's honestly like not a bad place to uh to train. Except for the, the Brutuses that keep spawning. But what are you gonna do? I'm on my last shot here. I want to get max ammo. And we can pick it up with our Hell's Retriever. I'm running out of ammo on this thing, too. It's <laughs> alright, we're about to get max ammo. Yeah, we're, we're so close. I am completely out of ammo. All I have is my retriever. Okay, here we go. And my grenades. We're right there, man. Just pick yourself up by your bootstraps. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> my dad told me ah, that. Oh, I told him oh, boost cap. God, I don't need this joke again. <laughs> there we go. Alright. Ah, achievement. GG Bridge. What? GG <laughs> Bridge. Yeah. Alright, yeah. before we end this, we, we both we'll have one more thing. Oh, this is cool. Look at this. Yeah. I was say, I feel like I should have gotten those achievements already, but. Yeah. How the fuck did I get 172 headshots with the vitriolic with her? I mean, when you do enough spread shot. That does not make sense. You're, you're right. bound to hit something. So for this next one, I'm gonna we're gonna load into the game, and I want you to just not touch it. Like you're both playing on controller, right? Yeah. yeah. All right, just put your controllers down. Just don't move anything. Okay. And just allow yourself to uh to run out of uh, afterlife. Also, if you look on the loading screen here, uh, at the top there, right to the right of Alcatraz Island, you can see the uh the golden spork there. We'll be trying to go for that on a. Uh, subsequent video Bob of the Dead part 2 a cat has nine lives yeah, After these, are all, uh, these are all the weasel notes that he's been taking from uh from the unconscious recollections he has uh, bro it's just like how cycle. It's just like how when she almost remains people's memories no one has fought to get rid of Dexon's notes <laughs> Well, it's more like um, every cycle they ha they forget that they like lose their memories, but Weasel starts like writing notes all on the walls and stuff, and that allows him to like trigger some of like his unconscious memories, and he starts learning more and more about like what's happening each cycle. So, uh, let's sit here until we run out of a uh, afterlife. Are Weasel and these guys friends? Uh. Weasel's kind of the odd man out in that they work with him, but no one really likes him, and they don't really trust him. <laughs> his, name, his name's Weasel. His name is Al Al Arlington, but they call him the Weasel. So, we're gonna get a uh, special little. Is this gonna be a jump scare? Game... Like... No, nah, it's gonna be a special game over screen that you get. That's one way to break the cycle. <laughs> That's a, a rendition. Let me actually uh, get the actual name. Um, oh, no, that's wrong. The wiki is wrong, guys. The wiki is wrong. That's a that's a variation of Samantha's lullaby called something. 
I don't remember what the actual name of it is, but it's a special little ending you can get. Okay, that's cool. So, uh, yeah, we'll do a, another part of this so we can get the Hell's Redeemer, which is the upgrade to the Hell's Retriever. We'll do the music Easter eggs. We'll get the Golden Spork, and we'll just have some more general mayhem. Maybe we'll do some some upgrading of the traps around the map so we can look at that. Um, then we will do the uh, grief mode with Alex. Uh, we'll have a rematch between Alex and me and you guys. Uh, and then we can finish it off with the uh, Easter egg. So Sounds good. Sounds good. That was a lot of fun. That was uh, very successful. <laughs> Only one game, too. Unless you can't that last That's one. what happens when your map is good. It, it's <laughs> a really good map. And we can talk about it more uh, in the next one because this will have a lot more time to actually talk as opposed to just rambling on about stuff we're trying to explain for the first time. So... With all that said, this is Sal DeLuca signing out with Billy Handsome yeah. and the Weasel. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Bye-bye.